guys, Dr. Christy Ennis. Happy holidays. We all know the holidays can be a bit of a stressful time, right? If you've ever looked at your tree and gone, or your crazy aunt has gone, do you hear it? It's a funny squeaking sound. Hopefully that's not really the case for you guys, but if you do happen to have a little bit of stress, or you just want to happen to have a little bit of fun, this is a great holiday-themed workout for you guys to share with your family. Get that stress down a little bit, burn some calories, and loosen up a little bit too. All you need is your body today, and these are all holiday-themed exercises. And we're going to start standing and end lying down, so you can always do this on the bed too. So let's get started. We're going to bring our legs apart a little bit wider. Hands are going to go on the hips. And I'm calling this bowl full of jelly because we're going to go ho, 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 right in a circle. <laughs> oh, I really had fun making this one today, I got to tell you. So a little bit of shakes as you go. We're going to do five in each direction. And you, you can even put your hands right on your belly and feel those abs totally engaging here. Okay, and then switch it around. Nice big circles. You can always take that little shake out of it if you want to. But here's three, four. Again, really tilting that pelvis side, back, side, and forward. I'm going to get one more because this side's feeling a little bit tighter to me. All right, from here, we're going to go into a wide, big star pose. And the, whoo, really big and wide, obviously. And then tree. <laughs> so star and tree. There's two. I'm going to get 10 on each side. Three. Here's four. Five. Very balancey, obviously. Six. Seven. Eight, you can bring that foot down low or high, wherever it feels comfortable. There's nine. And here is 10. Here we go, other side. Big star and tree. <laughs> That's one. Two, three, obviously if you need to hang on, it's okay. <laughs> Four, five, and today's workout is part of Follow Me Friday, where I always have a strength, a mobility, or even a little cardio workout. Seven, eight, and clearly themed workouts. <laughs> Nine, and 10. Okay, now we're going to take and we're going to put that tree on top, the tree on the star. Jeez, too much eggnog. We're going to take that star and put it on top of the tree. So rising right up onto those toes, reach and place. Up onto those toes, reach and place. For two, three, four. Working those calves, getting those shoulders going. Five. You could always use weights too if you want to. Six. Seven, eight, you can always do one leg, two, nine, not me, and 10. Okay, and this next one is actually my favorite. I'm going to call it Take the Cat Out of the Tree. So reach right into that tree, give a little toss. Reach and toss. There's two, three, we're going to add a little squat, four, five, Six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. I have had to take my cat out of the tree many times, but I don't toss her. Here we go. One, two. Sometimes you kind of want to, though. Three, four, five. Six, you can always take this squat out if it bothers anything. There's seven. Whew, breathing hard. Eight, nine, and 10. <laughs> All right, from here, we're gonna do little toy soldiers. So opposite arm, opposite leg. One, two, three, oh, geez, four. I'm gonna knock something down today. Five, six, seven, eight. Nine, loosening up those hamstrings. Ten, ten, nine, 
eight, seven, six, five, four, oh my goodness, three, two, very enthusiastic, and one. Last one standing, I'm calling this the pretty angel. Oh, okay, we're gonna, I'm going to turn and face this direction. Arms are gonna come overhead. We're gonna squeeze those elbows down, come into that little single leg deadlift, just like squeezing angel wings, and then come and reach back up. So here's two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Other side. Here we go. Arms are going to come up. I'm going to shift my hips back as I squeeze into those shoulder blades. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and one more, and 10. Woohoo! Okay, we're going to get right down onto the ground. All right, now for the ground portion. Here we go. Again, remember you can do this on the bed if you want to. We're going to do little snow angels, but of course we're going to work the abs. So really think about gently pull in that belly button to keep those lower abs engaged. And we're going to go bring that knee in as that arm, that arm, those arms come around. So there's one. We're going to alternate. Two, three, four. So 20 total. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. You have ten more. 10, 9, 8, really pulling into those shoulder blades too, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Good. Okay. Legs are going to come up. Make sure you keep that spine. Don't bloop or push those abs out. And I'm going to do a slow motion little kid temper tantrum after opening all the Christmas presents. So here we go. We're going to reach. And you can even go eh, if you really feel like you need to, too, because sometimes adults need to throw a temper tantrum also. <laughs> There's four, five, six, seven. I'm really reaching from those obliques. Eight, nine, ten. You have ten more. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. And one, and then the last pose is the parents after Christmas. <laughs> we will call this the flopping pose. So now's the time for you to think of you. Unwind a little bit. Nice, big, deep breath. Think about the eggnog that's waiting for you. One more big breath. Awesome. And I do want to give a big thank you to all my new Patreons. Please, if I forget your name, I apologize greatly and also let me know. But Salman Brandon, Matthew Fetty, Matt G, Bob Wolford, J Pack, Max Manning, Jonathan Hart, Addie Blue, Rodney, Monica, Mary Morris, and Mike Key. Awesome. Thank you. If you guys want, check out that Patreon page where I put videos that are nowhere else but there. 